it was amazing to think something running through Brazil could have properties that would make better computers. It's just unfathomable. Could these iridescent beetles carry the secret to faster computing on their backs? For one BYU student, discovering a remarkable structure inside the scales of these beetles was a life-changing experience and one that is attracting like worldwide so attention. We sat in the microscope room and we just looked at it and we all went, whoa, because <laughs> it was just so beautiful, so pristine, and so perfectly structured and ordered. We'd never seen anything like it before. What Lauren Ritchie discovered in a BYU lab was a natural photonic crystal, a structure that could help scientists to harness and channel light in optical computers and other devices. So any time you want to try to channel light, control light, manipulate light, you're going to use a photonic crystal. You could use it in lasers, you could use it in photonic integrated circuits, you could use it in fiber optic cables. The crystal Ritchie discovered is considered a champion 3D structure, the type that scientists have been searching for. You couldn't believe that you could see such beautiful, perfect structures inside of a beetle scale. It is comparable to a diamond. It has the exact same periodic lattice structure as a diamond. Beetle scales themselves can't be used inside computers, but they can provide a template, so scientists can manufacture photonic crystals, which, in optical computing, would function like a semiconductor functions in an electronic computer. Nature has this way of making structures that we cannot make synthetically because they're so small. And so we're using nature as templates in order to make these photonic crystals. Richie made her first photonic crystal discovery in high school. It was her science fair project. By her freshman year at BYU, she was already co-author of a scientific journal article with researchers from BYU and Utah. Having somebody like Lauren in the lab is, is phenomenal. She was doing graduate level research as a freshman. With an ORCA student mentoring grant from BYU, Richie is continuing to look for clues in nature that could have application in industry. With insects, you have this whole new array of different possibilities. You have this huge possibility to make photonic structures. So I really think that everything that we ever need to know is probably buried in nature around us.